Hi, I'm Marjorie Ramers Davis, creator of the Fast and Easy Way to QuickBooks Online Pro Advisor Certification. I got a question the other day. Somebody asked, what is the difference between the personalized path and the training library inside your Intuit Pro Advisor training portal? And I thought, wow, that is a great question. I should make a quick little video about it. So here we are. Let's take a look. So here I am inside my uh, uh, my accountant account. This is again QBO A account. And if if you don't know what a QBO A account is, you don't know how to get your free account, then make sure you click the link below. You can learn everything you ever wanted to know about the whole Pro Advisor program and free training and all of that good stuff. Um, so here I am inside my QBOA account. You can tell that you're in your QBOA account because it says accountant tools up here and it says accountant right here. Also, the left navigation bar is a different color than, uh, than it would be otherwise. So, um, so inside your uh, QBOA account, you'll have this option that says Pro Advisor. And if you click here and go to training, then this is what that person was asking about, is we have this option for personalized path and training library. So if I go to personalized path, then it's gonna ask me basically what my goals are. And if I click get started, I'm, it'll say what do you want to learn about? And I'll say, hey, and I, you notice that I can only select one. Um, I have the option of QuickBooks Online or QuickBooks Online Payroll. Uh, payroll fundamentals, I don't know why these are not showing. They're supposed to be bookkeeping fundamentals and um, uh, I think maybe it says advisory. I don't know why all of a sudden it's not showing there. But anyway, so we're just going to click QuickBooks Online because that's one we care about right now. And um, so I'm going to click Next. And it will ask what exactly I want to learn. So I, I can select, I'd like to learn the basic features of QuickBooks Online. I'd like to take the QuickBooks Online certification pathway, or I'd like to, spe or to choose specific topics to learn about. So if I select the uh, certification pathway and click Submit, it will take just a minute to build my, uh, build my path. So here I'm going to say, now that it's done, I'm going to select show my recommendations. And then I can at any time revisit the training personal, uh, personalization and choose different things. Um, or I can just go to exactly what they selected for me. Now, because I have in this account, I, I don't have my advanced uh, or I, I don't have any certifications yet. The first level of certification is that basic level certification. And that comes primarily from uh, the intermediate skills in the training library. And we'll show you that in just a second. So it's going to show you the path of what it is that they want you to study and you'll, you can see here, here um, for QuickBooks Online Solutions, this is one of their modules, the intermediate skills, it has pulled out for you the things that you want, to, that they want you to study. Then in the getting started section, they have pulled out the things that they want you to study, okay? So you can see here, let's just, let me just point this out, uh, QuickBooks Online Solutions, I'm gonna close that up, Getting started, I'm gonna close that up. Sales and customers, intermediate skills, okay? So that is the personalized path that you are supposed to study to, uh, to get that certification. Now contrast that with, let's go over to the training library. The training library is where they have all of the training that's available for you. So it's not just the things that are pulled out. So in the personalized path, just the things you need for the certification are pulled out, but in the training library, you have everything. So here we go, this should sound familiar. Here's a module, so I'm sorry, here we are, QuickBooks Online, 
And then here's the module, QuickBooks Online Solutions, Getting Started, Sales and Customers. Remember, those were the same categories that we saw before. And when you click on one of them, you'll notice that they are divided into uh, beginner skills, intermediate skills, and advanced skills. Not, not, not all of them have all three, but um, this one does. And if I click on the intermediate skills, these are the individual lessons, and then the um, you can hover over this little icon and it will tell you this is tested on the QuickBooks Online exam. If I go to the advanced skills, then and I hover over on that same icon, it says tested in the QuickBooks Online advanced exam. So the training library contains everything that you need, um, whereas the personalized path just picks out those things that you need to study specifically for the exam. Now, just a couple of things you need to know about this, uh, this path is um, that it's not in the same order as the test. So when you go to take the test, um, I can just show you this real quick. Uh, if I go to, uh, well, how could I have taken the test already? Well, let's say, all right, resume the exam. You'll notice that the exam has five sections, okay? But it just says section one. It doesn't say getting started or sales and customers or um, it, there's no way for you to know what is actually covered on the test. So if I go back to um, training here, here's my personalized path, okay? So if I open this up again, you'll notice it, there's nothing that says section one. It doesn't, it doesn't match up for what's on the test. I mean, how, it, how it's ordered on the test as, uh, as well as on the, uh, in the training. The other thing about the training here that they provide you is um, that it's really a lot of reading. So reading, 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 reading. There's a few things that are uh, videos every so often. So I don't know if I can even find one here. Here's a little video. Okay, so sometimes there is a video, but mostly it's just reading, reading, reading. And there are, there's no hands-on practice. There's no exercises for you to actually be able to learn those things. So if you would like a faster, easier, better way to study for the test, if you're finding the, the training inside into it to be overwhelming or confusing, if like me, you're not a good reader and you really need to hear it as well as have that hands-on practice, and if you would like to be able to study in exactly the same, uh, in the same order as the actual test, as the actual test, then head on over to fastandeasyqbo.com. We've got you covered. Links, of course, are below, and I'm happy to answer any questions. You have a great day. I can't wait to hear your success story.